afternoon everybody my name is Gigi and you are watching Anime Palooza. Today I have a very very special unboxing for you and it is my first by itself I guess I don't know. Yeah first by itself Ami Ami haul. <laughs> I've done I feel like a lot of Ami Ami orders in the past few months just because I don't really know how the website works and I wanted to try it out and see everything that I could do like shipping wise. I don't, you know, don't know the best way to ship things and I wanted to give myself a lot of options. So of course, you know, I ordered a lot of stuff. I have not one, but two Amiyami orders to unbox for you today. This is the small one. Let me hold it up for a second. This is the small one. Um, there's one that could easily fit my four-year-old niece and my two-year-old niece and maybe my five-month-old nephew that's sitting on my bed right now that needs to be unboxed. So I don't even remember what I ordered, to be honest with you. I remember one thing because it's currently why I had to pay a gazillion dollars for EMS shipping for the big box. And it's currently sticking out of it right now. So let's see what I got. Let's get our unboxing on. So this box came sell small packet. So that is... If I recall correctly, the option that is the cheapest but takes the longest to ship. So I believe I paid for this order on January 9th and today is February 15th and I just got this box today. So if you've never ordered from Amiani.com before, it is a site that sells Japanese figures and like merchandise <laughs> from anime and stuff and you know it's authentic because it comes straight from Japan. You pay in yen. So the first thing in the box is this Amiyami card. Same Amiyami card I got the last couple of orders. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff in here. Okay. I don't remember what I ordered. One of my newer obsessions is Yomushi Petal and I got this thing with Makishima in it. <laughs> I don't even remember what it is, but I got it because it had Makishima on it. So let's just open it because I, I don't know what it is. <laughs> it took about five weeks to get to me, so that's not horrible. Plus it's the least amount of shipping you pay. Okay, this is an acrylic stand. It's small. I thought it would be a lot bigger. They made one of these for Hisoka and I really want it and of course it's sold out, so I can't get it. But this is like, you don't want to break this. This is kind of fragile. What do you do with this? <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna try and put it together. Good job, Gigi. Talk about all the crap you buy and then you can't even put it together. So I got him in, but I don't know how to get this background in. Okay, so here's my little Makishima acrylic stand. He is standing in front of his giant TV, which if you've seen the anime, you know about. If you haven't, well then I guess I just kind of spoiled you. But this is really cute. I thought it was gonna be a lot bigger. This is him in his chibi form. I don't know where I'm gonna put this. I think I just got a whole bunch of stuff and I don't know where I'm gonna put any of it. Um, so we'll just put it down here for the time being. Oh wow, I didn't know they were gonna come with this. So this is a little candy jar full of Yo Mushi Petal, I don't know what it is. Straps, like keychains or something. I really like the container that it came in cause I'm gonna put a lot of shit in here. And not all this stuff is for me. Some of it's gonna be for giveaways too. So these are little blind bags. <laughs> If you bought the case, you get the whole set of whatever the hell it is in here. These are small. These are cell phone straps. These are tiny. It's literally like a strap, cell phone strap. So here's the, the one that I pulled out. It's so small. I thought this stuff would be a lot bigger. And who is this? I don't even know who this guy is. Team 2. Oh, oh, okay. I know who this is. This is um the guy who's on the second years, I think. Who am I supposed to get in here? I'm going to have I can't believe I forgot who this character was. I'm going to have to rewatch it, but I got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 of these. These are super small. I, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. I, I must have thought they would be a lot bigger. I thought I got more functional Yo Mushi Petal things, but apparently I didn't. Okay, so this is the thing that I ordered that I was sure that came in the very first box. These are Diabolic Lovers. I am, are they more blood or are they regular? They're regular. They're Diabolic Lovers Deco Rich. I make keychains or something. 
I bought the whole set. Because they're Halloween themed, so they have little pumpkins and stuff on them. It says they're made out of PVC, whatever they are. And they come in little blind boxes, of course. So here is one of them. And we're gonna take one out of the box just to see who it is. You do get the whole set with these. You get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I got eight of them, so I don't know what the last one is. Chaser! Oh, they're pins. They're pins. Oh, these are cute. <laughs> okay, so here is what it is. It is it's a pin. Like you can put it, you can pin it on shit. Like your backpack, your shirt, or your jacket, or whatever. And this is guy with the glasses. Re Ragey? Shit, I can't even remember their names. But he's dressed as Frankenstein. Oh my god. These are adorable. These are adorable. I'm really happy I bought them. And they were on sale, which means I like them even more. Did buy this used. This is pre-owned. It's, it's figure quality A, the box quality B. As you can see a little bit, the box is a little nick down in the corner there. The corner is a little bit crushed, but that's okay. This is a Sega AG Square Mommy figure from Madoka Magica. I love Mommy. She is best girl. Well, she's second best girl. Hammer, I guess, is best girl. And she comes with a lot of stuff. So I like her. She's really cute. I like this. I'm like that I got it. I love Mommy. And this is a game prize figure. So if you wondered what a game prize figure are, this is it. I can't wait to take her out. I don't know where I'm going to put her, but I'm going to put her somewhere. Let me get this little thing out first. This is Diabolic Lovers something. It looks like Yui. I don't know what this is or why I would order something Yui voluntarily. She must have come with something. She's cute though. So I, I don't really know what to do with this, but she's fucking cute. She looks like a petite chara. And she comes with a little, um, something you can like hook onto a keychain, but she doesn't come with a keychain. So I, I don't know what to do with her. Her hair is kind of ombre, so it's really cool. And it's got the little hair accessory. She's super detailed. She's way cute. Whatever reason I bought this for, I like her. And I bought some Sailor Moon Twinkle Dollies. I bought the whole case. I did get one of these in a box before, and I really liked them. So I bought the whole set. This is set number three. This is an official toy product. So if my nails look jacked up for the rest of this video, I'm sorry. Now I'm just gonna claw into shit. They're so fucking cute. Okay. Even ugly chibi moon is cute. Oh, they're all the same. No, they're not. Okay. So we got a couple of different twinkle dollies, and if you haven't had these before, these basically just hang on stuff. They're little cell phone charms, but I think they're adorable. So we have Sailor Moon, and we have two of her. We have Chibi Moon on Pegasus, and we have two of her. No, I have three Sailor Moons. We have Princess Serenity on a moon, which I'm betting is the reason why I bought this, because I love me Princess Serenity. I have two of her. <laughs> this is the other reason why I bought this. <laughs> Slutty grown-up Chibi <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, she's BA. I have one of her. Really? Only one slutty grown-up Chibiusa? Yeah. And the other one is Human Luna. And I have two of her. So these are definitely the extras that are going to be going in some giveaways of mine. And I didn't think that I was going to get so many, apparently. But I have ten of them. These are super cute. So look out for future giveaways. If you pick from my giveaway box, you're probably can pick one of these out of there more than likely except for grown-up slutty chibiusa she's mine and this is the last thing in the first box this is where that yui extra figure came from so this is a diabolic lovers van dead carnival these are those little teacher figures this is gonna be a bunch of characters i don't know but there's a lito in here which is all that matters in life so yui was like the extra figure if you bought the whole box two four six eight ten of these and apparently each one is like 600 yen a piece, so these are like $6-ish figures. I'm hoping I pulled out Lito because I'm just going to take one more out to show you. Oh, I got, um... Wow, Lilac's going to kill me, as is everyone who knows that I love Diabolic Lovers and I can't think of the goddamn character names. This is the main guy. These don't come with little keychain things either, they just 
come with something like you can put them on a keychain. What is this? Well, this is the guy that everybody likes. <laughs> and again, he has ombre hair and he's super cute. And I really love these. Oh, these are cute. I love Diabolic Lovers. Okay. I'm going to clean up some stuff so I can find a place to clear to put my coffin box so I can actually open it. So give me a second and I'll be right back. Okay, so I opened the coffin box and before I start with the things that are lined up so nicely here, we're going to start with the thing which is why I had to get EMS shipping and why it cost so much, which was a Sailor Moon umbrella. I have a thing for umbrellas and to be honest with you, I had a Hello Kitty umbrella that I really, really, really enjoyed and it melted, it caught on fire. So. This will be my new umbrella of awesome. And I don't know if you could see it, probably not, because I really don't want to open oh, okay, I'll open it. Ooh. <laughs> this is so cool. I want to do my whole video under this umbrella. There's Princess Serenity and King and Mian or Queen or whatever on this umbrella. And I had to have it. I had to have this umbrella. I mean, no joking, I had to have this umbrella. Now, this box came EMS shipping if you're playing along with the home game, and it cost like $85 to ship this box. It did come in a week, but I mean, never again. And apparently because it came with that umbrella is why I had to pay so much in shipping. So the next thing that I got are these game prize figures from the Madoka Magica series. I got all three of them. I have Hamura, and this, these were pre-owned, I think. Yeah, these were pre-owned. And I have Sayaka, and her box is a little beat up. And I have Madoka. So the only one I'm missing is Mommy. I need to find Mommy. I have to. So she can complete the collection, because... If I don't have mommy, I'm just going to be nice. So <laughs> these are the Presto game prize figures, and I did buy all of these pre-owned. The figures were A quality, and the boxes were all B quality, and I can see little flaws in all of the boxes, but it's okay, because clearly I'm sitting them here, taking them out of the box. I'm going to open one of these, because I've never seen them, and quite frankly, I'd like to see what they look like. Because if it's a Monica figure, I'm probably going to buy it. I think I have to put her together. Sounds accurate. All right, give me a second. I'm going to put Monica together. Okay, so this is really cute. This is my Monica figure. And as you can see, she is standing up on a base. She's not like super detailed, but here's her face. But she's detailed enough. And it's detailed enough to be super cute. You have to peg her in to the board to the base and the base is super cute so I really like these they're not like super super detailed but they're great for what I would use them for paint flaw whatever these are really cheap <laughs> and I like them I'm running out of space I don't know where I'm gonna put these but I have three out of four so if anybody sees that mommy pre-owned come up on Amiami let me know so I can snag her Oh, well, I had to buy not one but two Makishima figures from Yo Mushi Paddle. This is the Palm Mate Makishima, and this is brand new. This just came out. So this is brand new. And these are made so that they also have a stand, but you, they're made so that they can sit in the palm of your hand. And I saw the Otaku Mom got one, and I got one too. Actually, I got this before I knew she got one too. But I love him. I love Makishima. Yeah, I like this figure. This figure is like super crotch time. Okay. And then the other one I got was the break time figure of Makishima, which is him sitting, like they're made so that they sit, like they sit on like a bookshelf or something. And this is pretty cute too. I'm not gonna, did I, was this one new? This one might've been new too. I'm not going to take these out right now because obviously I have no place to put them, but you can bet that you'll see at least one of them sitting over there next time I redo my wall. If you guessed that this was basically a box full of Monica figures, you're pretty much accurate. I also got this game prize figure from Ben Presto. 
This is the Homura in the white dress figure. Again, I bought it pre-owned. Box is B, figure is A. And I can see a couple of dents in this box, which is why it was, you know, on sale. I don't have Monica yet. I don't remember why I didn't buy her because she was up for sale. Um, but now that I'm looking at this picture on the back of the box, she is pretty cute. So I'm probably going to have to buy white dress Monica too, just so you know, they're friends. They can be together. I got another one of those deco rich things like the Diabolic Lovers ones, but these are Yo Mushi Petal ones. And this came with a bonus one too. So this one is, um, oh, the guy I don't like. Um, the guy with the big eyes. I don't like him. But I bought this box specifically because it had Makashima in it. So we'll just open the guy who I don't like. Name escapes me. He's the creepy guy with the big eyes. You know, if you've seen Yo Mushi Petal, you know who I'm talking about good these are pins too I can't believe I can, well no I can believe I can't remember any character's name because I can't remember any character's name ever even though I just watched the shit out of Yo Mushi Petal full season these are really cute okay so these are pins also and you can see all the little detail everything is like popped up and stuff on the back it's a pin so these are super cute I have the whole set of these plus this little bonus one. Time for my Nendroids. If you guys didn't know, I recently got my first two Nendroids ever. They were Anna and Elsa from Frozen. And then I bought three more. So the first one, obviously, is Monica. I'm telling you, I just can't stop with the Monica Magica figures. And this one is in the old Nendroid box. She's number 174. She comes with a cube and three different faces. And hello. She's super cute. Oh, and I also have that Sebastian Nendroid that um, Lee Kino gave me, so I'm going to put him up too. Again, pre-owned. Then, I got Mommy! And this is Mommy in her school uniform, which doesn't really match the other ones, but I bought this one because she came with a Charlotte, and she also came with a table, so I was like, that's cool. She has two faces and a shit ton of accessories. So I got her used this again. All the, all the used ones I bought were box. B, um, figure A. Then for the crowning glory, which is not from Monica Magica, I had to get her even though she was more expensive than her normal retail price and she was pre-owned. Yes. Kuro Yuge Hime in Android form. And <laughs> she comes with a pig. She's number 249 and she comes with a pig. She comes with three different faces and the wings. Wait, where's the pig? I don't see him in here. I don't know. I'm going to have to open this and see. But I love Kuro Hime. And when I saw they made her in an android with the wings on and she has a little angry face too and a super happy face and supposedly a pig, which I can't find in this packaging, I had to get this. Even if she was used and more expensive used than she was when you could buy her. Um, the first time. So she is from Excel World, in case you were wondering. And she goes quite nicely, so she'll- oh god, I need a bigger space. I just need space. And that was everything in this huge Ami Ami haul with a coffin size box and another little box to go with it. I think I kind of went overboard. I think I'm going to have to stop buying stuff on Ami Ami. Said no one ever. But let me know your thoughts about this video or my Ami Ami haul down in the comments below. What was your favorite item? Um, mine is my little Palme Shima and this, obviously. And the game price figures are really nicer than I thought they would be. I love, I just, I like everything that I got. And some of this stuff is going to go in giveaways too. So yeah, I'm super excited. I hope you all enjoy your little presents that you get if you when I have another giveaway. So let me know your thoughts and I'll have a little party down in the comments. As always, please feel free to follow me on Twitter or my anime list. My username is AnimePalooza at both places. And until next time, love your faces. Oops. So the next thing in the box is an Amestris State. Oh shit.